At the top of Mount Takatosan in Wakamatsu Fukuoka, there was a pond with clear water that attracted many kappa. Different kappa groups would fight over the best real estate around this pond. One year there was a serious drought. The lands were dry and the hot sun shone from the sky every day. Most ponds and rivers in the region were out of water. The only pond that still had water was the pond on top of Mount Takatosan. Consequently, the kappa of the region all moved here and fought over the last few drops of water. Unfortunately, the nearby villagers also needed the water. This resulted in many cruel fights for survival among the humans in the kappa. A Buddhist priest named Domalu Sogaku heard about the fights between the kappa and the villagers, so he immediately came to Mount Takatosan. He had been involved with these wicked kappa before and was successful in defeating them by fighting them off with gourd leaves. Sogaku thought that he could help the villagers by subduing the kappa here as well. He asked the blacksmith of the village to make him a long nail of about 30 centimeters long. Then he climbed Mount Takatosan, sat in front of the statue of Jizo at the top of the mountain, and began his prayers to subdue the kappa. If my prayers are answered, then this nail will stick out of the back of the Jizo statue and all the kappa will vanish, never to appear again, said the priest. When the surprised kappa heard his prayers, they wanted him to stop. One kappa changed into a beautiful lady and tried to seduce the priest but he was unbothered as he knew this was a trick. Other kappa offered the priest money, while others changed into huge serpents and threatened his life. None of these proved to be successful, as Sugaku didn't move an inch and continued to pray night and day. On the final day of his prayer, when Sogaku was already very exhausted, he suddenly saw one place on the back of the Jizo statue become soft as tofu. He called on all of his strength and struck the nail into the stone statue. At that moment, all the kappa who had been threatening Sogaku disappeared into thin air, never to come back again. Shortly after, the water began flowing back down the mountain to the villagers, and all were saved. Even now, if you visit Mount Takatosan, there is the nail in the back of the Jizo statue. It's left there so that the kappa will never come back again. <laughs>